Hey! Hey, Mrs. Wade! Sydney uh, Jenkins. Come on, let's go inside, Here, Marlo. We want to talk to you. Oh, is this where I'm supposed to say, what is all this about? And he says, uh, shut up, I ask the question. Yeah, yeah, that's right. And it happens every day. Right profile. Sit down. Sit down. What the hell are you doing here? That's right. I'm going to read this thing. Swan. Swan. When some passerby invites your eye to come her way. There's going to be a lot of people looking for me as a result of my lovely wife. If it was a murderer, he murdered his wife. That's a lie. I know he didn't kill her. I'll tell you something else. It's a minor crime. A minor crime, a misdemeanor to kill your wife. The major crime is he stole my money. Your friend stole my money. And the penalty for that is capital punishment. Even as she smiles a quick hello, you let her go. I like your face, too. Could you find my husband for me, please, Mr. Marler? You let the moment fly. I'm a man cannot stand confinement. Who the hell are you? Well, I'm this here private investigator who was sent here this afternoon to uh, find you. Did you come here to see me or my wife? It's not his business. Write the check, Roger. What check? Write the check, Roger. Whoa. Lady, you turn your head. You know you said the long goodbye. Never learn. You're a born loser. What do you think, Mabel? Ow! If you have any trouble, I'll back you up. I have fresh evidence now for you to reopen the Terry Lennox case. <laughs> you ever think about suicide, Marlboro? Me? I don't believe in it. Goodbye. Don't you try to be nice to me now. I'm leaving and it's goodbye. I ain't running after you in the rain when you're catching a plane. No more. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. I'm through, I'm through this time and I mean it.